looking back on my own life, I realized that I grew, I, I grew up when Rayan was born. This is a great day. This is a perfect day to this love story that we see unfolding and will continue to unfold before us. The first time I met Brad, I really didn't meet him. I just uh, happened to drop Rayan off at school and I saw this little kid come up there and go, <laughs> yeah, I was wondering, who's this little brat with a skateboard hanging all over my daughter? And Rayanne, from the first time I met you, really from the first time anyone has met you, and they see that gigantic, gorgeous smile, they know that you're just full of life and excitement and adventure. And you have uh, very many awesome qualities, and Brad, was lucky enough to see those even as a teenager and somehow even early on and this is a love story that's been happening when you guys were just kids it seems um, but he saw something in you that was amazing that he knew this was something to hold on to you know I fell in love with Rayanne when a friend of ours came to the house after she was born and he came to the door he said i want to see your new baby i flipped back the covers i had her in my hand and i flipped back the covers and i looked at her and i was like wow she's the most beautiful girl i've ever seen when you were 15 and he asked you to go out with him you told him that he had to wait and he did, he waited for two months. And for a teenager, that's at least like a decade in teenager years. I love how you basically said, if you want me, you're gonna have to wait. And he did, and here we are on this day, waiting this long for this love story to continue. And so the assignment was to explain why Rayanne would be a good teacher. I was writing this essay and realized I was writing my maid of honor speech. Um, and so it was not just about how Rayan would be a good teacher someday, but how she is a great friend and sister and wife. That shows that his patience, you know, to wait for someone that was special and all the things that he saw in you, um, it was worth it. When you bought a promise ring early on, it wasn't a promise ring to marry her someday, it was just a promise ring to respect her and treat her right. And that promise is still carried through to this day. He has treated you right, and I know, I'm confident, as we all are, that you will continue to do that for the rest of your life. But this is still just one day of your love story. You're going to have thousands of future days where your love will have opportunity to show itself. It's been so exciting watching you guys grow up together, and now you're grown-ups. And I'm really excited to see you guys on your next journey together and grow in love together. Um, I love you both, and Brad, I love you. I'm so glad you're officially part of the family, not like you were before. <laughs> they are a prime example of what true love really is. Brad, I just wanted to let you know that, that I loved her first. Now you have the distinct honor of loving her next. So here's the Brad and Rayanne. Rayanne, with all of my love. Brad, with all of my love. I take you to be my wife. I take you to be my husband. I will love you through the good and the bad. Through the joy and sorrow. I trust in you completely. Together we will face all of life's experiences. I promise. I 
promise. I will be your loving partner. Best friend. For as long as we both shall live. Ran with this ring. Red with this ring. I bind <laughs> myself to you. I commit myself. To loving you for the rest of my life. Now, in the presence of all these friends and family, and before God, I pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride.